Hey guys, this is your girl Alicia Pink, and this is from my Pisces. How are you? And this is going to be seeing what's happening for you the next 72 hours, starting today, February the 11th to February the 13th. What is the energy that's going to be surrounding you guys? Okay, so um, we're going to start this video with some smudging. All right, some smudging. And before I get started, I would like for you guys to subscribe to the channel, okay? Like, comment, help the channel grow. Also, if you would like a reader from me, I do readings on my Etsy shop. Or you can email me. Everything is linked down below, okay, guys? In the description box. So we're going to start this reading with 3D breaths, okay? Let's go. Breathe in. <sighs> Breathe out. Breathe in, <sighs> breathe out, breathe in, <sighs> breathe it out. Okay, Pisces, this is your reading. Okay, we're going to start with the new moon. Tonight is a new moon and it's a new moon in Aquarius. So let's see what's the energy that is surrounding Pisces. What Pisces needs to hear, what Pisces needs to know for this this new moon. Okay. I'm calling in my angels, my guides, my ancestors for an accurate message and an accurate reading for Pisces. What is the energy surrounding Pisces? I'll say work through your fears. New moon in Scorpio. Let's see what else, Pisces. What else spirit has for you? Okay, so you got a new romantic cycle begins. New moon in Libra. I like that. Let's see what else. Okay. And you also have a time for healing. Blasphemic moon. So my Pisces. My Pisces babes. Okay. It's a time for healing. Time for self-care, self-cleansing. You know, self-care is always a must. You always have to make time for yourself. Also, romantic cycle is, is beginning. You know, it's, it's about to be, you know, Valentine's Day. So, you and your boo, you know, even if you're single, you could take yourself out on a date. Okay, if you are already in a relationship, you and your boo can be getting closer this weekend. You know, work through your fears. New moon and Scorpio. All right, time to work through your fears. All right, let's see what else spirit has for you for my babies, my Pisces. New moon in Aquarius. What's going on? What is the energy surrounding Pisces for new moon in Aquarius? All right. So you got potion. Remember to practice self-love. Then I just not say that. This is the perfect time to do some self-love rituals. It is the new moon. So do some self-love rituals, self-care rituals. You know, get a pink candle. You know, get a cute little pink candle. You know, uh, it could be a birthday candle. Put some, some um, what you call it, some honey and some some sugar on it and just talk you know sweeten yourself up write your name on the candle and um say i am bringing self-love and self-care i am sweet i am being more sweet more loving to myself you know something like that with some jasmine or herbs and things like that cinnamon so you got except um expectation don't seek anyone's approval okay pisces please don't don't seek anyone approval also make a change you know um stop comparing yourself to other people pisces okay um you know with this girl she's cutting your hair maybe you could change it up by getting a new hairstyle or something of that thing just changing your whole persona or just you know just doing some mirror work speaking positive affirmations to yourself pisces okay that's so beautiful so spirit wants you to not compare yourself to other people do some self-care some self-love rituals and change it up a little bit let's see what else spirit wants you to do pisces What else do you need to see here, Pisces? 
for the next 72 hours. What's coming your way? What you need to hear? Alrighty. What else do Pisces need to hear for the next 72 hours? Okay, so you got six of cups. I mean, six of pentacles. So you might be getting some blessings in the next 72 hours or helping someone else out. Helping someone else out. You also got the Knight of Cups. So yeah, you might be um be getting help from a lover or somebody that really is, is fond of you. You also got the Page of Wands. You're going to be learning something new. Eager to learn something new this week as well. Might be um in your studies. Creating some balance, some peace, having a sense of peace, oneness, wholeness around this time. This Queen of Wands. I love Queen of Wands. Okay, you are most definitely getting more. You are going to be attracting the right people into your life. That's going to help you move forward with maybe your career or um, something that you're trying to create, something you're trying to manifest. They really are going to be around to help you okay with this queen of wands and this chariot card also with this um you your wish literally when i pull this card i just heard your wish is my command and i know this is all about you know opportunities but spirit is literally saying like you, Pisces, <laughs> I'm not saying it's just because I'm a Pisces though. <laughs> With the seven of cups, I'm so serious. You Pisces, y'all are so magical, okay? Literally, magical. You can literally manifest anything, okay? And it will come, it will come so fast. But I really feel like with this page of cups, your emotions get the best of you not being able to manifest. Hello, look at the fishy. That is you, my fishies. That is you. You're a fish out of water. And like you are so powerful, okay? Your wish is my command. You can literally manifest anything, Pisces. I mean, it will be a battle. It will be a struggle. But you will get through this. You will get through this. Okay? Let's see. I feel like in the next 72 hours, somebody, maybe a mentor, maybe someone that you're close with, is really, you're going to break this down to you. And you're going to have a, like, a, what you call it? Like a, a aha moment like a light bulb like a like a light bulb moment go off in your head like oh my god like why didn't i think of this like sooner like this is so easy i didn't know how easy this was and that's how you're going to be feeling pisces okay let's see what else spirit needs you to hear i don't want to make this video too long Okay, this is a lot that go on got out. I don't need all these cards. Okay, you got the ace. That's you, Pisces. Your energy all over. So spirit is saying to you that yeah, you're you're gonna get an overflow of blessings, okay? Ten of coins, your guides, your spiritual team is one hundred percent behind you and one hundred percent has your back. But you really need to take action with this knight of wands. You really have to, um, this Eight of Cups, Blessings of Tapon. This next 72 hours, Pisces, is going to be really good for you. Blessings for you, for sure. You really, with this Knight of Wands, you really have to be passionate about what you want. And you really have to know what you want. It's the new moon. This is the perfect time to do so, Pisces. Today, if you are watching this today on February the 11th. Please, by all means, Pisces, write down your intentions and your manifestations. I guarantee you it will come true with the with that your wish is my command. I really feel like all of your wishes, all of your manifestations is going to come true. It's going to be an overflow of blessings. 
Okay, also with this Five of Swords, this Eight of Wands, yeah, there will be difficulties. There will probably be setbacks. There probably will be setbacks. But you're good in the end. Pisces, if you don't get it together, I don't know what, what to do right now. <laughs> I don't know but yes do do what you need to do do what you need to do i feel like you're gonna have a light bulb moment in the next 72 hours this probably needs to come from someone else probably a mentor probably a spiritual teacher or some of that nature and it's really going to make you like oh my god i didn't know i could do that when i'm connected to joy joyful presence I attract support from the universe and there is a stream of love supporting my dreams so true and then you have I'm unapologetic about what I desire and trust that what I focus on will grow beautiful let's see what else you need to hear Pisces okay then you got peacefulness. I have a peaceful, tranquil, and untroubled heart. This is where I choose to spend my time. I can bring guests, but any person, thought, or event that brings drama or chaos is not invited. My heart is a special priority, and I'm going to keep it that way. So when I when so when can all keep enjoying it and I can get my security deposit back okay yes your heart your body is a sanctuary and you should not just let any old body have access to it okay that's what's wrong with us Pisces right now we need to really realize that um we just can't let any old body have access to us okay we are divine and we need to treat us treat our bodies like a sanctuary i see and then you have i am transformed i see the beauty of change everything i have been through transform me into who i am today i am so much braver i am so much more caring i am so much more emotionally intelligent i am so much more open i will continue changing and improving i am transformed that's crazy i did a um new moon reading for myself earlier and I shared it and this card came out once again so I feel like you Pisces all my Pisces are going to have a huge transformation and a huge aha light bulb moment that's going to set you off and you really need to use the energy of today to create and to manifest whenever you are going to see this this is timeless so if you don't see this around the new moon on Aquarius, whenever you're supposed to see this, take this as a sign that this is the time to manifest. This is the time to create at this very moment. Okay, and that's that. So thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe down below, and I will catch you next video. Bye.